Alcohol plays a large role in criminal activities and violence. In Jeju, three out of ten suspects for violent crimes, including murder and theft or violence, were under the influence of alcohol. Todd Thacker reports. A man enters a police precinct in the early hours of the morning on March 26th. He staggers under the influence of alcohol, pointing and shouting at police. He banged on the door of the precinct for over 20 minutes after being thrown out and then returned to cause more trouble. The man, who is in his 50s, created the disturbance at a police precinct in Jeju City after a police officer instructed him to pay for a taxi. This is another CCTV clip recorded at a different police precinct in October last year. A drunken man in his 50s shouted abuse at a police officer who was explaining how the man's offense would be dealt with. Soon he lost his temper and was physically abusive. He was arrested for creating a disturbance at a government office. In Jeju, alcohol-related crimes, including making abusive remarks and assaults, are common. Last year, 19% of suspects arrested in eastern Jeju, or about 2,000 cases, were under the influence of alcohol. Over the last three years, the rate of crimes committed under the influence of alcohol has dropped. However, last year, alcohol was a factor in 36% of violent crimes, including murder and robbery, and 31% of simple assaults. The rate of crimes committed under the influence in eastern Jeju is higher than the national average. Notably, the rate of repeat offenses has hit 90%. Jeju Dongbu Police Agency, which covers eastern Jeju, will strengthen patrols near Jeju City Hall and Dongmun Rotary during the hours when alcohol-involved crimes are more prevalent. Police will also beef up measures to prevent repeat offenses, such as offering counseling services to offenders upon their release. Todd Thacker, KCTV.